They said it couldn't be done. They said I was insane. But I showed them. <laughs> but I wonder, has science gone too far? Dwellers, my name is Dan Arcama Films, and welcome to a Minecraft mod showcase. Wait, he he's saying the words that he hasn't said in years. What's going on? Well, today I've got something for you that I think you guys can appreciate a good meme. I think you guys might like Fortnite. If you don't, that's fine too, because this mod has lots of things besides that. But you're probably wondering what I, I just saw Steve do the Fortnite dance emote. And you are not wrong. Uh, this mod adds in different emotes for your character to do, actually changes the animations for every basic action. It has a lot of work into it. Uh, this was made by uh, MC Horse. He's the guy that made the Blockbuster mod, the Aperture Camera mod. So he's a really, really big influence in the Minecraft Machinima community nowadays because his mods can do lots of cool things. If you've ever seen an animated player skid, it's because of his Blockbuster mod. It's really, really cool. Now this mod lets you wave, it lets you uh, dance and shoot out particles. It's it's really cool. And it has a really intuitive design. There's Orange Justice for those of you who, Fortnite, I love Fortnite. Look at this, this this is a thing. This is this is something that is, uh, that is happening right now, yep. This is happening. So <laughs> it's pretty cool though. I like this one. It's the, it's the, ugh. I like this one. It's the, uh, the popcorn emote. I'm still a little sick, so sorry about that. So it's, it's the popcorn emote from Fortnite and it's, uh, it's pretty cool. So let me show you what's going on. Uh, if you press the P button, you've got access to this whole little list here of different emotes that you can assign to keybinds. You can go into your config files and change the keybinds if you want, but uh, as of default, they're on the numpad. So we've got right now, Wave, sup dude? Star power, no autographs please. Or it's justice. It's also a great exercise. And popcorn, I just came here to read the comments. So uh, they also have these like really funny blurbs that kind of describe the emote. So you can just uh, basically select any emote and the way you change the uh, the keybind is you just click the uh, the one you want to change the keybind for, and you just choose the new mode. So now I can do Marlon's exercise in Boneless, and there you go. You also get like a little preview of your character doing the do. Uh, particles don't show up here, so if you want to know if a, a moat has particles or not, you'll have to go through it. So there's the bow, the boy. What are those? It a lot of the memes, memes. I calculated, can't dig straight down if you don't have any tools. You got the chicken dance. What's wrong, McFly? Chicken. Oh, hi, Mark. Uh, clapping. Uh, confused. So there's a lot of general use ones, too. Like, I would use the bow, the clapping, the confused, the crying. I would never use the dab, but I know some of you guys like to dab on dim haters, so that's there. Uh, and now we got, like, the default Fortnite dances. We got dance moves. You got the... Yeah, you know that. Now the sounds that was post edited, they don't actually come with the sounds, probably to stop copyright from happening. But uh, yeah, you, you've got all the Fortnite dances that you could really want. You got Disco Fever, Electro Shuffle, another meme, Face Palm. Ugh. Who in the world does that? There's the Floss one. Yeah, yeah, I know you guys like that. Look what I can do! Fortnite Floss! Let's do it! Mmm! Yeah! Yeah, floss. Just floss everywhere. Oh, man. Um, besides the floss, we got uh, fresh. Like, look at these. These are really fluid animations in Minecraft, too. You got hype, infinite dab for when the haters are too many. You got to dab forever. Um, we've got laughing. No. Orange justice. Yep. The popcorn, the pure salt. Yes, you can do the salt bay meme. You can do the salt bay meme. I, I kind of like this one a lot. It even has the particles. Look at all that salt. The salt mine. Salt is a way of life. Anyway, um, yeah, it's a really cool little small, easy to install mod. Now there is something I have to tell you about though, because unfortunately this mod is great, but it's not perfect. Uh, 
just going to go through the last couple of emotes. Now, it makes sense. It really does. You put all this effort into a mod to make it really awesome. You want credit for the mod because a lot of people use mods and they don't even link to it in the description. And I don't like that either. I always link to the mod, especially when I'm showcasing the mod, because the reason why you're clicking on this video is probably because you want to put this mod into your game and you want to have a link to download it. I, I, I'm just assuming that. Um, so unfortunately, again, he's great for Machinima. Uh, MC Horse, the creator of this mod, he does a lot of really cool things for the Machinima community. However, when you press F1 with this mod installed, it has something that's kind of a bit of a bummer. It has this powered by emoticons watermark at the bottom. Now, normally, you know, when you're doing your daily gameplay and stuff on a server or whatever, that's not going to be a big deal. It's really not. You know, it's a great mod for what it is, especially if you're just playing with friends. But for Machinima Makers, which in a way is really the target demographic of what this mod is about, you've got this gigantic pile of text that you can't get rid of. Uh, it, it's just there. There's no way to get around it. It's it's here. It's powered by emoticons, and it's here to stay. Now, again, I get it. You, you definitely need a... Um, you need like art or attribution to the creator of the mod. It makes sense. However, I feel like it could at least be toggleable, or there might even be like I don't know a paywall for people that want to do it. I I don't. I just feel like it being there all the time is not the best thing. And that's all I'm going to say about that. Let's go show you the default animations that the mod does. So you've got running, we've got walking, we've got sneaky sticking. There's also a fly animation where you're kind of like Superman-ish. It also reminds me of the swimming animation too. So we hop in the water here. But uh, you know, it, honestly the swimming animation kind of reminds me of the update aquatic. So that's pretty cool. Now this is for 112.2, so it's like right when the update aquatic comes out. Um, well actually no, the update aquatic, yeah. I think I just dated myself as to how bad I am at Minecraft versions nowadays. However, anyway, this is for 112.2, so, you know, buyer beware. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you want to see more content like this, please let me know. I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.